How could David have been near enough Zack's plane to save him? Do you know we were there? Or that Zack was coming for us? It couldn't possibly be a coincidence. It, it, it couldn't be. Not with Hayward. Whenever something bad happens, Hayward is nearby. Can't argue with that. Okay, so then why do I get the feeling that you're not on board with this? I am, Ryan. I mean, of all people, I know what David is capable of. And, and I, I don't have an answer as to why he was there when Zach's plane went down. Okay, so that's what we got to find out. We don't have to. What are you, what are you saying? You want Hayward to, to skate free? No, but think about it. If he was in prison, would, would Zach be alive today? Would Kendall and the boys have their father back again? So what are we supposed to do then? Are we just supposed to forget everything else that Hayward has done? No, I'm just tired of David Hayward being the center of our lives. Yes, yeah, so am I. Yeah, well, that's where he's going to stay. If you keep trying to get to the bottom of God knows what. Dixie's here, Zach's here, David's a miracle man, and right now, I don't want to know what he did to make that happen. Yes, David drugged me and he locked me up, and I would love to strangle him for that. Yeah, he deserves that. He deserves that and more. Yes, but can't someone else do the strangling? <sighs> I mean, I am sure there's a long line of people ready to do that. We've been down that road too many times, Ryan, and it's cost us. It's cost us everything. I just, I can't sit around and let him get away with all this. Remember how guilty we felt when Zach's plane went down? We thought he died trying to save us. Of course I remember. Yeah, yeah, well, I would have given David anything to have saved Zach. Is that how you're rationalizing? I know it goes against everything we feel about David, but Zach will be coming home to Kendall and the boys. Think about that. Think about Dixie and Tad and Kathy getting her mother back. Think about us and all the time that we've wasted on David. Please, Ryan, let it go. Just let it go. So David worked another miracle, right? Not yeah, except there's always, always strings attached. Can't we just celebrate Zach for a little while? If David knew anything about that plane crash, yes. when Zach is back on his I know, feet... I know, there are a lot of people who can go after him. Can we please just go home now? I want to spend the rest of the night in your arms. Yeah. You've been pretty quiet. Hmm? Why do you look like you're about to cry? I don't know. I was just, um... I was thinking about how David lured me away in the first place. By making you think that Leo was still alive. He knew that would get to me. He always knows. Which is another reason that we need... Never mind. Okay. You were saying? Well, after David drugged me, I... I saw Leo. I mean, it was just a dream, but... He was standing there with me in that room and it felt so real. He was alive and I was so happy to see him and we talked about everything, even you. Yeah. That, must, that must have been so intense. It was. Some of it. You know, Leo will forever be part of my life. I loved him very much. But you and me, this is where I'm meant to be.
It's okay, you know. What is? To carry your past along with you. All your loves and your heartbreaks, everything. It's just a dream. The past does have its place. But what really matters is the present and the future. And for me, those words will always mean you. Thank you.